In this lecture, we will cover the sixth tool of quality, that is, control chart, also known as run charts. We will get the answer to these questions. What is a run chart? Why are run charts important? When should run charts be used? And then we will see an example of a control chart. Let's start the lecture. What is a run chart? A run chart is a line graph of the measurement of the product or process over time that has statistically based control limits placed on it. In simple terms, a run chart is a line chart that visually displays data over a period of time. The run chart helps us to see process performance over time. Next question is, why are the run charts important? To display and manage variation in process output over time. To identify when a process changes. To distinguish special from a common cause of variation. And to tell the operator when to take action and when not to take action. And the last question, when should run charts be used? You should use the run chart whenever you want to understand how your process has performed over a certain period of time, or when you want to see if the changes made by your project resulted in sustainable improvements. Now, we will continue with the same example. Time is taken to reach office, and see how it is plotted in the run chart. Here, we are plotting the mean time. The blue line is the mean. Then, there is an upper control limit set at 6.50 a.m. and lower control limit is set to 6.10 a.m. The upper limit and lower limits are tolerances. So, if I am coming within the upper limit and lower limit there is no issue. But if I cross these limits and I have to look into my pattern, this is how run chart display and manage variation in process output over time. In this lecture, we saw what is a run chart, why are run charts important, when should run charts be used, and an example of a run chart.